God help me. Um, so you might have noticed some strange happenings. Yeah. Um, let's just say I accidentally didn't record anything. For, um... I, yeah, I accidentally didn't record any... Th yeah, no, I didn't record anything totally. No, I just... I didn't, like, completely forget to check if the mic was even functioning until five minutes into me complaining about OBS. Speaking of which, God, at least this gives me a chance to complain more about... Okay, that's clearly the place where Lando... Or Lando? Lando, what the hell am I smoking? Where Han shot something. I don't know what he shot, because I don't want to get angry fans. Yeah, sorry. Good morning and welcome back to Lego Star Wars 2, the original trilogy, where we're going to show off a fun feature of the game before kicking it into high gear prior to the release of the next LP, which is going to be Night Trap. Night Trap. Ooh, something, something, Night Trap. Anyways, uh, oh, I just missed one. That's lovely. Why are you chasing me? Thank you. See, that's my issue. AI can kill fucking enemies in this area, but they can't kill them in the other areas. Bullshit. We're four grand away. I'm not... I'm not playing a level for four grand. I don't, I don't really want to know. <laughs> I'm just going to go back to here and make the realization that, aha! That was useless. Anyways, and that's, oh my god, I missed New Hope's room. Who knows what I'll find in here? He said, knowing he'll find, like, just enough to piss him off. Oh, actually. I'm just... I'm betting I'm being pissed off by what I get out of this. Oh, look, my dog made another appearance. Woohoo! And licked my kneecap. That's interesting. Oh, you've got... I predicted it. Just enough to, like, actually aggravate me. Like... So close! <gasps> yes! Okay, now we're happy. I'm going to move back a bit, because I'm loud, 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 Anywho, moving back over to the cantina bar area, we're going to go to the extras menu, and hit use old save. And then... It'll save, ironically. Go to extra, yeah. And walk into a free play level. Boom! got very confused for a second and boom we suddenly have older we have younger Obi-Wan Kenobi Obi-Wan Kenobi from episode 3 the Jedi Master Obi-Wan Kenobi wait a minute I'm confused Jango Fett, General Grievous, Darth Maul Mace Windu, Mace Windu from episode 3 Grievous Bodyguards, Droidicas uh, Battle Droid Battle Droid, Battle Droid, Battle Droid TC-14, Wookiee, Chancellor Palpatine, Madme, Padme in the battle, Padme Claude, Padme Geonosis, Christ, they have a lot of variants, Queen Amaldama, Amala Damala Amala, Super Battle Droid, Kiai Mundi, Ki Adi, nope, not pronouncing that, Kit Fisto, 
L- that's just... You, you stole your name from a Harry Potter spell. Shakti! It's probably offensive. Clone. Clone. Oh, here we go. Clone. Pilot. Commander Cody. Clone. Another clone. Disguised clone. Anakin Skywalker. Boy. Boba Fett. Boy. Geonosian. Anakin Skywalker. Jedi. Anakin Skywalker. Padawan. Captain Panaka. What a weird character. Jar Jar. Who let him in? PK droid. Why? Royal Guard. Count Dooku. And Qui-Gon Jinn. Hold up. Where's Darth Plagueis? No, not Plagueis. Darth Sidious. Where's Darth Sidious? Is he unlockable? Anyways, to describe it shortly, this feature allows you to import most of the characters from the first Lego Star Wars. And not much else. Um, yeah, it just... It's all it does. <laughs> now you're broke! Can't even afford Rebel Troopers. Anywho... Eventually we'll buy all of these guys, including Gonk Droids, which still cost 1,550 studs, because of course they do. And then we have some ghosts that cost a million, 1.1 million, and 1.2 million. And then Bounty Hunters galore. Basically you have to buy all the Bounty Hunters to do some cool fun things. Then you get some more of these things. They're called, they're called Spaceships. And that is their only name, Spaceships. Fun times. Anywho, that was boring. But it was something I felt you needed to see. I don't care at this point. Uh... And yeah, that's all it does. It allows you to use some old characters in free play, which is actually quite useful because I don't... Actually, yeah, I, I'm going to check because it's an interesting thing to wonder, is this a quick and dirty way to get access to Sith characters early in the game? I'm just going to do some quick checks. Uh, yeah. You, yeah, you don't unlock Darth Vader until well into um, episode, what's it called, episode six, episode six or uh, Return of the Jedi. You, you basically don't unlock him until the second last mission of the game, so if you really wanted to complete it as you went, this would be the only way to do it, because you get a bounty hunter, Jango Fett, who would have detonators, which would be a boon. And then you get Count Dooku, Darth Maul, which is, yeah, I mean, that's a really nice, it's a nice spread, honestly. Yeah, it's a, if, if you do have the opportunity to play these games separately, um, don't. Just play the complete saga. It's on 360 PS3, We. Don't play the first two on the... Like, play the second one on its own. That's fun. But uh, if you're... Oh, God. I can't explain to you how many times I wanted to, like, throw the controller through the game devs while playing the first game. And it's not even when you do it casually. It's when you go to finish it, there is nothing in place to help you. And it's just... It's annoying. It truly is. It gives you no desire to go back and finish it because once you're done with it you're like oh it was fun but then you go back to 100 percent the game and you're like whoa what did i did i say fun i meant hell <laughs> but with lego star wars 2 it's i mean everything's improved you have um just overall the engine was made functional Comparatively, uh, the UI, which honestly stuck through the next installment, 
And the, the list of characters was better because, I mean, A, a it was the original trilogy. Prequels are okay, but I always say to people, hey, at least the prequels produced Lego Star Wars because that's about the best thing to come out of them. And the lightsaber fights. And, I mean, John Williams was always good at scoring films, but those were never going to be bad. It's the parts of the film that feel forced. Sorry. Um, I always say, hey, to Jar Jar's credit, he's a useful video game character. That's, that's, I had to slip that in there, because that was my favorite joke for a while. Because he always, he'd joke about how bad the prequels are, but... Hey, it's more Star Wars movies, and that can't always be a bad thing. Even though, sometimes it is. Anywho, um... The best part about this game is these. Is the times stud multipliers. So times 2, times 4, times 8, and times 10. I think times 6 was added in Complete Saga because, like, it makes the sense. But then you've got some times 2 other things as well. And all sorts of stuff. It, just the game's overall better. And use old save is really a boon for people like me who wanted to go back and finish these games as an uh, adult, almost. I'm not quite an adult. I'll never be, like, a mature adult. But I'll always legally be an adult after some undescript time. Anywho. That'll be all for today. Um... Hopefully this turns out halfway decently. I mean, the, the, the more I look at that godforsaken overlay, the more I want to just not do face cam anymore. I think I'm going to stop doing face cam after this Let's Play. After this video. After this video is over, no more face cam until further notice, until I can either get a better one and make it look pretty, or honestly, at this point, I did it out of thinking there wasn't going to be enough on screen. I think I'm just going to have to put some actual effort in. Who knows? I'm going to try my hardest to make everything look good, but after this video, no more face cam until further notice. Unless it turns out great, in which case, hell to the air. But that pretty much wraps it up. Um... I'll give my full thoughts on these games once I've finished doing the collectathon work for this one, which should wrap up around the time. Oh god, those videos are gonna be like three hours long. God help me. Anyways, once I get those done, I'll give my full thoughts on both games. And until then, um, just had a stormtrooper walk by in his G-string. That's nice. Anyways, um, I have been a not drunk, but wishes he was when he plays these games. Nerd. The, the word fuck. Um... And as always, just don't play the first one. It's not good. Like in any way.